Hi guys, welcome to PE with Dylan. Today we're going to have a look at the triple jump in a bit more detail. Now the triple jump as we know it is the hop, step and jump. Okay, so the hop, what defines a hop is that you're landing on the same foot. So whichever your, is your takeoff foot, you need to make sure you land on it. For example, a hop is like so. That's our hop. After you do your hop, you're going to switch onto the next foot. That is the step component. So let's have a look at that together. Hop, step, and then you launch for your jump. That's how the jump works. So you get your hop, you step, and then you push off into the pit. Let's see how that is in action in a moment. All right, guys. So to work out where we're gonna take off from, we need to have a rough estimate of how long our hop and step are going to be. So what I suggest you do is you get onto where the, your pit is or where you're jumping to, and you want to have three to four large steps. So if we go one, two, that's about where we want to do it. I've got a piece of flat bark. You might be able to have anything that's flat just to mark where you're going to start your hop, step and jump from. I'm going to put mine on that blue line and that is where I'm going to uh, start my uh, triple jump from. Now I've got to measure out my run. My run is going to be anywhere from 12 to 15 paces long. I'm going to work that out now and uh, I'll see you at the start line. After you've done your first attempt, mark the spot where you landed and try it another two or three times. Hopefully, you can increase your distance of your triple jump. Good luck, and I'll see you next week.